Hello everybody, this is Sonia and I'm back again now today to um, show you a couple of things that I bought today. It's been Friday, I like to go shopping Friday. Okay, now uh, I didn't get anything new. Oh, I did from eBay because I got some things off eBay. Um, and then the rest of the things I bought um, at one of our opportunity shops. Now, ribbon, uh, 99 cents for a fair bit, a fair bit, really pretty, spotty, really pretty spotty pink ribbon, satin ribbon. Now, there's a fair bit there, I want to unroll that, so I was really pleased with that. Now, <laughs> have a bad habit of buying things without really taking that much notice of the size. These little flat back pearls. But I think now when I think when I look a bit, they don't look too bad. They're supposed to be all blue. And I think there's supposed to be a thousand here. But there's some green ones and some blue ones and they're the ones that you you would stick on. But I think they would look really nice to make little things onto cards or stick little things on, you know, like Anyway, I haven't got any of these colours, so I'm really pleased because they really are pretty colours. They're really, very really pretty, so um, I thought they were probably a lot bigger than that, of course, because uh, I didn't really pay attention to what I was doing. I'm ter terrible happy to do on that, you know. You think, oh, they're, they're good, I'll just bid, I'll bid on those. And like I said, I go through bidding on heaps at a time. I might only, you know, I get one or two occasionally, but I usually get outbid. And then there's some green ones, and they're really nice, really pretty colour. So anyway, I wasn't too too disappointed with that. I also got <coughs> another one of these. This is um, the mould that I bought like before. I got a blue one. I think I showed it to you actually. It's right here because I've been playing around with it now. This has got a um, a, a bit better thing in it, I think, because this is like <coughs> it's okay. Now I tried to do this with polymer clay and it was a disaster. No, is that that? That's not true. I tried to do this with air dry clay and it just would not work. Could not get it down into there far enough to, to for it to work. So I seen somebody on there doing that with the glue. With your glue gun you just pour it in there because it doesn't stick. Hot glue doesn't stick to that. So I tried that. Now you gotta be you know, don't be too judgmental because I'm trying to I'm still working on this. The that's what it look it looks like this when it comes out. Then I added some colour to that, and I, will, I wasn't very pleased with it because it's too many, it's very, very tiny, so I couldn't really put the colour of leaves and everything there, but this is the second one that I did, and when I get around to colouring that, which I could probably just do a little tiny bit of, um, let me see, I've got a little bit of red ink here. Now, this has amazed me amazed me because I mean the hot glue gun doesn't get don't get on that well but you just you just squeeze it into that thing and then I thought well we just rub this over and it brings out there's a flower there see probably not the best I probably didn't pick the best one in the world to do but I figure if I do that that's like um tulipy thing and then I can colour colour it after I don't know I'm gonna it's all all gonna be experimental so I'm <laughs> just working on that that's something that I was just just having a go at because I, I really wanted to try that to see because I've seen some people have done them I don't know what to paint them with but anyway that'll, that'll all come that'll all come in the, in the long run so also I bought few bits. I got this piece of, um, they had it there where the scarves would be, so I don't know whether somebody decided just to cut a piece of this out, but this is all sequins, this is all over that, so I know that I could buy that from a material shop, but I don't have a material shop that would sell me this So in the town, so I'd have to go to Spotlight or somewhere. So I picked that piece up because I think I could probably use that for something, you know, that's a, that's a good thing. Uh, I also found these that somebody must have made these because they've got a um, felt thing on the back of it there and 
They've, they've done a lot of work on making that, haven't they? Look at that. It's got a brooch on it, but I'll take that off. That one hasn't got nothing on it. So, But somebody's actually put these together as, what I don't know, but I'm going to make that a flower centre. That would be an absolute beaut flower centre. Lots of threading on, you know, that they've done in this work. Save me all that. <laughs> you know, or you could put it on anything, really, couldn't you? Just say so somebody made that up into a brooch, but I won't. I won't be using it for that. So anyway, so that was all right. I wasn't wasn't too disappointed with those. Um, I also bought this because I liked it. I thought this is really nice little container, and you don't get many little good bargains like you've got a little bit of fluff in this and the fur. This little glass dish, and it was really pretty. I thought that was really nice and I could and it's really good cut it's like a cut glass thing. It's a really um nice heavy little thing. So if I just pick up a nice little thing occasionally, you know, that's not gonna take up too much room too quick. Okay, so down in here I've got some more bits. I found these earrings that were they've put them onto a piece of card. I'm not really sure whether it needs to for me to because I'm going to use that flower. So whether I'm going to fix him up and make him a bit more brighter, which I probably think I would, and just cut the back off, or, or leave the back and build it into a stem. And um, so that was what I thought. I seen something in that. And then I got this here, like a little heart um, bow, and a heart, I should say. That, that That's really cool. It's really cold too, actually. <laughs> That's really nice. I was really pleased with that. Um, so she didn't charge me very much for that. Now I've been picking up a lot of these lately because I wanted to, like these book things, because I don't have a very um, big arrangement of stuff that I can use. So I don't know whether I can take the part out of this. Right, it opens and reuse it. See, I'm thinking I might reuse the whole thing to do an, an album. You know, like, um, well, I'm sure everybody understands what I'm going to try and do with it, but I want to turn it into something a bit more interesting. <laughs> I don't know how to put it back together now. Yeah. I'd be sure I was going to catch my fingers in that. <laughs> anyway, um, so they got that. Uh, I was also quite taken by these. Now, I know I'll I don't know what I'm going to do with them, but they're letters. Now, these would be fantastic, I'd, I'd imagine, in a kid's mini album or something. You know, because they're really, really neat. Really neat, these are. And I thought, well, if I don't use it for that, I could finish cutting out the bee properly, I suppose, and use it on something. But I thought these would look fantastic in a kid's um, little book. You know, you could put it in with the little kiddies' um, things. That's what I haven't done a kid's mini album. I have no idea how to go about it. So, and I love giraffes, and there's one there. I love that. And there's a nest. Look at that. And it's for nest, but they're very good quality things. And I thought, well, look, Sonia, you know, the lady charged me, I think I paid $6 for everything, and I've got a couple of, um, well, there's more of those there. And I've got a couple more things, of course. I could see an LEC ideas in everything. Now I bought Nemo because we got windows. And I'm thinking about taking poor Nemo out of there and planting something else in his place. You see. I don't know. But I, I, I see things and I think, oh dear, now that could work. You know, you've got, you've got your... Um, it's wasted to me if you just put it out there and nobody does anything with it. You know, cover that, paint it with gesso, put really nice little photos in it or something, even use it as a kid's one. Um, I don't know. Uh, I love that story, Nemo. I reckon it was one of the best kids' stories I've ever seen. But anyway, um, I just wanted that because of the the, the, the panels in it, okay? Um, I hope you understand what I'm trying to achieve here because I really, I really um, like to do things with... with hardly anything at all and this is, must be last year's Christmas book and I bought it because it's still got the paper in there the free paper that they give you with the with the magazines 
5 cents for the magazine, I get a nice piece of striped paper and lots of ideas on what to do with it. Okay, so that's what, <laughs> that's what I did with my shopping today. And um, I'm just going off now because I'm going to switch this off and I'm going to make another video on my swap, secret swap thing that we're doing, okay? So I'll be back in a minute, I'll talk to you later.